Right, is this thing on? Great. Well, I hope you're all ready for this talk. Um, I'm certainly not. This is usually this is usually a speech that I give half drunk in a bar somewhere to a potential consulting client. Um, I'm hoping it'll work here as well. So, five dead cons in five minutes. Why am I qualified to give this talk? I'm not very prominent, I haven't accomplished any great thing, but I have been to almost every DevCon, except the one that was in Gavin Wood's living room. So you can see here proof of t-shirt. Um, I did think of the obvious thing of just like stripping through them on stage. That idea did not survive beta testing. You, you wouldn't appreciate that. So. Um, as with everything, in the short story, I'm going to impose a narrative arc on what I'm doing. So this is as much perception, my perception, as any reality, but I would see the DevCon's roughly going like this. Nerds met Bitcoin, that was the very beginning. We were then a grown-up technology, very respectable. We were rich and fabulous, does anyone remember 2017? It's not a point of honor, but it was fun. Followed by cry and build, I would describe that stage as. But it's still a time when a lot of progress was made. And then people discovering society. So, uh, DevCon 1 was really small. It was basically the size of this room, except reasonably full. Um, it had one line for coffee. That was the only catering that we had. Um, Casper, proof of stake was first mooted here. Um, a lot of stuff was said about the benefits of smart contracts, and it had a sort of nice academic feel. Um, the DAO was proposed there, I think, in a side event, um, and Ethereum was denial of service attack. Um, you'll notice a theme on that. Uh, and here is an example slide. You can see it was a very, very, very nice hall. DevCon 2 is my favorite DevCon. Um, because I seemed artificially cool, because Shanghai is a confusing and artificial and scary environment, and I'd already been there five or six times before, so I looked like I knew what I was doing. Um, this is when it really became respectable. We, IBM was there. People had stalls. People from Chinese local government showed up. Um, it was great. Um, for very obvious reasons, um, safety and security were big things, formal methods came in. Um, it was still very much bring your own nightlife. People just hung around the hotel or said they were going to certain bars. Uh, Vitalik was in, I think, the Sheep's Head pub it translated to quite often. Um, and it was, it, was, it was very small. You could just go up and talk to Joseph Levine. It was, it was very communal. Um, Ethereum Classic were there. If you want that story, get me a beer later. Um, the DAO was informally post-mortem quite a bit. Um, and in accordance with what was then tradition, Ethereum was denial of service attacked in the middle of the event. Um, but it was a lot of fun, as you can see. And the catering was good. It's also where uh, Pookie Booba's string games started, uh, which have been a constant feature. I'm not sure if he's doing them these years, but if you see people with just bits of string and sticks stuck, bits of uh, string and stuff stuck to themselves, that's because of him. DevCon 3, if I want to leave you with one image from this talk, um, my time has stopped, that's probably good. Um, if I want to leave you one image from this talk, um, it's me on a pontoon at a golf club at a party. I've been there for two hours without figuring out who is actually paying for it. Talking about mortgage security as well being brought whiskey. Everything was going to be great. There were lots of people who used to work in multi-level marketing. The corporates were a bit more quiet. A lot of stuff was focused on uh, use cases. There were also a lot of zero-knowledge um, side events. Um, DEXs came along. Um, it was all pretty good. Prague, the money went away, but there were lots of developer tools, and Prague is great, the beer was excellent. Um, it's probably the first time I felt that we had proper tooling for what we were doing. Um, so on the whole, there were a lot of paper dyes everywhere, and Blockchain's LLC was quite an event. 
um, there was a huge hall with this girl as a hologram. I still don't know who she is. <laughs> How am I doing for time? Okay, two minutes. Good, I'm okay. Um, Osaka, I think Osaka was a point where actually the money hadn't quite come back, but if anything, that was a good thing. A uh, lot of people looked at Ethereum 2.0. Um, there's a lot of talk about crypto law, and that was actually something people were starting to think about. You know, society, law, the general world, that was good. ERC721 came along, foreshadowing the NFT boom. Generalization of crypto kitties, which is previously when you did these things, you had to refer to them as something kitties. I did climate kitties for carbon credits at one point. And uh, Ava and Libra came along, which was cool. And Japan is generally beautiful. Um, I skived off a lot to go to the castle and stuff like that. DevCon Bogota is, of course, whatever we make of it. Um, everything is still to be announced, even the beer. Uh, the coffee has been very good so far. You'll notice I comment on that a bit. And. Here are many thanks to people on Twitter who helped me with things. Um, the pictures you see that are um, not mine are from them, and you can see that in the speaker's notes, which I think will go up online. I'll redact them in a minute. Um, and here are some really good articles about things that went on there that I would very much suggest if you enjoyed this talk. Thank you very much. Ooh.